Hey guys, how's it going? Today, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make any logo or simple photo into a printable STL file. So, let's get started. Real quick guys, before we start this video, if you're watching this video, you probably do a decent amount of 3D printing. And if you do, then you should definitely support United States based manufacturers like Coax 3D and use my code Austin's Lab for 10% off any order and support a United States based manufacturer of 3D filament. But now, back to the video. Alright guys, the first thing we are going to do is simply open up the interwebs and we are going to go to any logo we want. So I'm going to just choose a simple Liverpool soccer team logo. So here is the logo I want right here. What I'm going to do is save that logo and it's going to save as a PNG. But we want this to be a SVG document so that we can convert it into an STL file pretty easily. So what we're going to do is come to any website that can convert PNGs or whatever file type your picture is into SVGs. So this can be this website, freeconvert.com. It can be convertio.com. It can be whatever you want. But I'm going to use this website freeconvert.com and convert it into an SVG. So once we get this converted we can go ahead and download the SVG version. We'll go ahead and download. We can see it just downloaded right there. Liverpool FC logo SVG. And then what we can do is come to Tinkercad and Tinkercad is a free 3D modeling website. We can come to create 3D design and then we can come to import choose file choose our SVG and then we're gonna make the dimensions just 100 and then click in the box and it'll make the width um, this the the correct scaling and then we'll do import and then I'll go ahead and import our SVG as a flat model. And then once it's imported from there, we can go ahead and edit it and make it bigger to print. All right, so this just imported. Here it is. We can make it smaller or taller, whatever we want to do. We'll just make it about 10 tall. And then if we wanted to add a border around it, we could do that or we could just print it as is like this and maybe put something behind it and then center it like so but if you just wanted to print out this by itself what you could do is come to this tool put it over this guy Sorry, we're going to come to put on top like that. And then we can grab these tools and then make sure you come back here and turn our snap settings off. But then we're going to go ahead and connect this wing to that wing. And then we can go ahead, click it again, and do this for all the wings to make sure everything is connected when we go ahead and print it and then we can go ahead and make that the same size as our print and then when we combine it all together we can make the parts one just like that now this is all one sod part and you could do the same for this part this part this part and the rest of the parts that aren't connected but that is a really fast and simple way how to turn any logo or picture into an STL file for 3D printing. But again, one, time, one more time, I'll show you now. 
because um, I didn't show you how to make an STL file. We can click this and then come up here to export and click STL and export it as an STL file. So guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Just a quick way for you guys to make any logo you want into an STL file by, by first downloading the image, converting it into an SVG file, and then opening it up in Tinkercad, messing with your file however you want it. Once you're happy with it, then you can export it from Tinkercad to an STL file. So again, guys, just a quick way to turn any logo, photo into an STL file. Hope you learned something. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.